Today we're going to be taking a look at the best custom fit trailer hitches available for the 2012 Dodge Challenger. We're going to be taking a look at two class 3 hitches today. First we have our Kurt, part number C13236. Follow that up with our draw type, part number 76145. Now there are class 2 options available for the Challenger as well, but something that's kind of odd that we notice is even though the class 2 hitch is only going to have an inch and a quarter by inch and a quarter receiver tube opening, the bottom of them tends to be lower or closer to the ground than what we get in our class 3s. Now that's not a huge difference between the two, but it can certainly help going in and out of parking garages, driveways, situations like that. Now both hitches are also going to offer a 5 8 diameter pinhole. This is the hole you'll want to use to keep your items in place. You'll see on the draw tight, it's going to be the one located closer to the front of the vehicle. Both hitches offer plenty of room for just a standard pin and clip. Anti-rattle device or locking hitch pin should work out without any issue. One type of anti-rattle device is the J-pin stabilization system. That's the only time you're going to use this smaller hole. Now both of our hitches are going to remain visible underneath the cross tubes, which are like our square tube we see here on our draw tight. Our Kurt's going to have a rounded tube, but they're going to remain visible. The thing I like about the cosmetic look of our draw type is that we've got smaller round steel stock style safety chain connection points, which are a lot less noticeable than the larger plate style that you're going to see on the Kurt. Another thing to consider with our hitches is that when we're hauling a non-wheeled load, so basically anything other than a trailer, the Kurt recommends the use of the stabilization strap where that's not a requirement with the draw type. Now both of our hitches are going to offer a 2 inch by 2 inch receiver tube opening. It's going to make them very versatile and very useful. These are going to work out really good for your ball mounts, bike racks, cargo carriers. Just about any type of hitch accessory they make is probably going to come in a class 3 variety. Now our installation process for each of the hitches is almost identical using almost identical hardware. The only real difference that you're going to see between the draw tight and the Kurt is that the Kurt is designed to work with the quad tip exhaust. Sometimes you'll see that on the SRT or the Hellcat model. Whereas with the draw tight, it's only going to work with the non quad tip design. So if you have a quad tip vehicle, the Kurt's going to be the way to go. Now as far as the weight capacities on our hitches go, the draw tight is going to offer 675 pounds worth of tongue weight rating. That's the maximum downward force we can put at our receiver tube opening. The Kurt, it offers 350 pounds of tongue weight rating. The draw tight is going to offer 4,500 pounds of gross trailer weight rating. That means the total weight of our trailer, anything we load up on it. The Kurt, it's going to be down at 3,500. But something you really want to keep in mind, both of these hitches exceed the towing capabilities of the Challenger by quite a bit. So at no time would you ever want to get close to either of those ratings with your vehicle. Now let's sum up what we've talked about. When it comes to appearance, I prefer the draw tight look. It's a little bit cleaner and less noticeable. As far as ground clearance is concerned, it has to go to the Kurt. It does have about a quarter inch more. Recreational use, I like that the draw tight has that higher tongue weight rating. It means it should be a stiffer hitch and have less flex. I also like the fact that you don't have to use the stabilization strap. As far as towing is concerned, I think both hitches here are created equal. That's going to complete our look at the best trailer hitches available for the Dodge. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.